and welcome back to the channel. It's Reactions, Rants, and Rabbit Holes. You have found the place where we try to uh, stir the hornet's nest as much as possible. That being said, I don't know this tune. I've heard a few of uh, their songs. If you'd like to check out the complications and learning about this amazing music for me, there's some links. If you'd like to see what burr got under my bonnet, be under my saddle, poke him, you know, watch the whole day. I'm, uh, I am just in the middle of a guitar virtuoso super fast. I mean, it's just a marathon of amazing. Goose! Okay, I was gonna hopefully make it wait way longer. But there's a tag. You know, I got a I got a block on that so you can't always see me stop and start the, the video. But uh, I've been trying to make a point today. And before we get lost, because I've never heard this and I've heard almost every song otherwise. Only a couple songs I didn't know today. But up here, it offers uh, some tab. It pops up when we're playing it. Uh, info, yep, tab. So tablature uh, for your uh, up and coming guitar players. Now I'm not saying they can achieve, uh, it's Henson, right? I don't mean any disrespect, because uh, uh, the other members are, uh, I would say probably as important. Uh, yeah, I put it all together as a whole, a creative force. But I'm just talking about the guitarist right now. Uh, yeah, uh, Tim Henson. Now, I'm not sure every person who buys Tab can uh, achieve these abilities. But the songs are all transcribed so a person could try. And um, one of the points to pointing out internet haters is they spend so much time hating on shit. Excuse me, but they do. They should go get the guitar and the tab and get to work. Maybe they could create something amazing too. And through the, you know, the lottery of fate, get their break. But if you just want to dwell in the bringing everything down around you, how do you expect new things to, to flourish? I like that new things come my way, even if they challenge me and... Anybody who's been on the channel long enough can fill you in. I got challenged by this stuff. Had nothing to do with the guitar playing. Music is awesome.
right, that's it. We'll stop there. I, ha, the, the goose, I, I need that in there. And, and as I was um, poorly mentioning, obviously, uh, just because I don't know the names of all the musicians does not take away any of their parts in the arrangement or composition. Uh, whoever did what parts should get credit for that, right? Just because a person doesn't know it doesn't mean we disrespect it. This is some amazing stuff. Now, it also fits in line with this tender surrender. And weirdly enough, uh, some of this Gary Moore with the smoothness factor of the, uh, now, uh, definitely a lot more progressive than, let's say, that Gary Moore track. But the point is, uh, I'm sitting here thinking, and uh, uh, my idols are not your idols. And I'm... Uh, I don't want to partake in idolatry. I want to bring them all down to the same level and go, wow, this is amazing as that other stuff was amazing as the first track amazed me. And I'm grateful that my entire life, there are artists carrying on a legacy of just kick-ass guitar-driven music. There's my takeaway. And this is the newest of the bunch. And I'm just grateful it exists. Any of the factors that would put me over the edge, I'm going to let go as I move on to the next reaction because it turns out that weight isn't worth carrying. But appreciating something new, man, does that make my life better. I don't know. That's where I'm leaving it. Coincidence or homage or technique. <laughs> kind of like that uh, licked final note that Vi played. Not the same. Not the same at all. Not saying it's lifted, taken, or anything. When you write that down in the comments, you projected it into this moment. I'm talking about a loose coincidence only and an observation. If you watched all the reactions, it makes sense to you. But if you watch only this one, maybe you take it out of context. I like context. I like the fact the whole day actually has one purpose, but seven reactions. Because then when someone just jumps in for what they like, they're like, what the hell was all this? This makes no sense. Yeah, because you're a Fairweather fan. And I'm actually working for 15 people riding on the bus.
Wonderful. Now, like I said, I, I, I go with everything I said uh, throughout the day. But if I was going to make a bold statement, this, uh, this band is something else. Next level crazy good. But my opinion is for entertainment purposes only, and I believe in the subjective nature of art. So it doesn't matter what rise it gets out of me, and it doesn't matter what I tell, um, what, what I preach to the choir. Uh, hopefully there's one person who never heard it and was like, wow, that's, and then maybe discovers them. That's it. That part will have value and add something to someone. The, uh, I want to read the um, mainstream review for the 15th time. Ugh. But if I was all into that, <sighs> top of the game, man. This is just amazing stuff. Polyphia, Goose. I really liked the Goose. Oh, wow. The second comment. I would, if you're interested, the link's probably right up there uh, or at the end because I want to link the other ones because, trust me, the uh, the uh, Christian nature of the band and then the uh, imagery and goat alone, or was it goat or the other one? What was the one? Just was crazy. But I don't, <clears throat> I got past that. I lost the haters and the super fans that that mattered to. We'll keep anybody else who actually appreciates it and uh, I don't know, Robert, was that a that was a cool track, smooth. I think that went right in with that tender surrender and uh, to Gary Moore. Like you could play those three back to back, and they wouldn't. They go all on the same playlist. I really, I think. All right, we got one more to go, and it's as easy going as it gets. So we made it a long ways, and uh, we're just adding another tool to the chest. I can't help it. Sometimes you got to go out there and snatch the tool, buy it, you know, it's a hex wrench or a screwdriver, whatever you need. You got to add it to the, the list. You might need a new tool to poke a hornet's nest and then to spray it with raid. I mean, sometimes you need chemical warfare. Oh, there's that. It's on the channel too. All right. Later.